Well, all morning we've been talking about the Indonesian elections, which are underway, but why should you traders out there care about it? Well, our next guest is the person to tell you why. Here is Ito Warsito, President Director at the Indonesian Stock Exchange. Indonesia is the third best performer in the world, in the world, guys, this year. Most people say the market's already factored in an SBY victory. And now, Paito, are you expecting any more upside to the rally that we've seen? Uh, historically, the uh, July-August is a low season because of uh, most uh, investors are on leave. But uh, I think with the sentiment of the uh, new presidential election, uh, the market will still uh, stable at above 2,000. But the stocks have gained, what, more than 50 percent yet to date? Aren't the stocks looking expensive now? Yes, it's uh, um, more than 50 percent already. So are the stocks looking expensive, uh, Paito? Pardon? Are the Indonesian Hello? stocks looking expensive right now? Uh, not yet. Uh, because uh, most of, of the fundamentals of the companies uh, listed in, in Jakarta Stock Exchange are uh, quite good. But uh, still, the, uh, on the uh, price-to-earning ratio, the Indonesian stock exchange is still lower than uh, most of the regional markets. Paito, let me bring in my guest who's with me in Singapore, Karim Roslan, a political commentator. Go ahead, Karim. Uh, Paito, uh, I understand that the IDX has launched, uh, recently launched a commodity exchange. How do you see that uh, faring now? Uh, will um, Jakarta be pulling back more of the commodity trading, especially in oil palm and other such uh, commodities from around the region? Uh, I think it's, it's natural that uh, commodities, uh, even in the, in the future, will uh, dominate the Indonesian stock exchange because most, uh, I mean, Indonesian uh, are rich with uh, uh, commodities, uh, whether it's uh, uh, minerals, uh, oil, uh, energy, and also the uh, CPOs, so that uh, it is, as uh, I mentioned again, it's natural that Indonesia will be dominated by uh, commodity stocks uh, in the future. And uh, dependencies on the, on the, com yes? Paito, let me just jump in here and put a question to Karim. Karim, do you think investors are convinced about the potential? I mean, we've always talked about the potential in Indonesia, whether it's realized yeah. or not. That's another story. Well, I think the, the facts speak for themselves, actually, Haslinda. We've seen uh, uh, BAT, British American Tobacco, buying the fifth largest, I believe, or fourth or fifth largest listed Cretic manufacturer, Bentol, only a week or two ago. So, I mean, the savvy players are moving into the market. This is an enormous market which is growing. So, the facts speak for themselves. Private equity boys, the multinationals, now Indonesia is a place they have no option. They have to be in Indonesia. They do not have to be in Philippines, Thailand, or Malaysia. I'll be left behind. Paito, let me just come back to you at this point in time. As far as traders or investors are concerned, it's about unlocking value. Uh, in terms of IPOs, uh -huh. what's the potential there for Indonesia post-elections? Uh, I think uh, most of the IPOs uh, on state-owned companies will be done after the new government are uh, in place in October, uh, so that we only hope that uh, it's, it will be starting next year. The, state-owned companies will be uh, going public, uh, but most of the uh, private companies are uh, or will be uh, go public in the second quarter, uh, second semester this year. Uh, we have already seven uh, companies listed uh, this year. How about in terms of foreign listings? I mean, you said before that you're interested in luring them into the Indonesian market. How's that progressing, and uh, do you see that happening anytime soon? Uh, we don't think that foreign uh, issuer will list uh, in Jakarta Stock Exchange in the near future. Uh, but uh, we hope that most of the uh, 
Indonesian entities uh, owned by foreign uh, investors, uh, uh, which uh, let's say uh, have a, a concession in Indonesia, for example, in mining or energy, we list the, the stocks in Jakarta Stock Exchange uh, in the in the next three years. Uh, I mentioned about uh, Freeport Indonesia, Newmont Mining, and others. Mm, Karan, let me get back to you. I mean, how yeah. difficult is it to lure foreign players into Indonesia? Well, I think, you know, as things uh, become clearer, more transparent, you're going to find a lot of players will want to be in the th uh, fourth largest uh, economy, in, sorry, sorry, in population in the world. So Indonesia is going to be very, very attractive. But there's been a lot of hesitation. Well, the hesitations only to be expected. You know, we're only 10 years after Reformasi. I don't think people understand quite how stable Indonesia has become in the past 10 years. People have to go and see it and realize that really, you know, the most difficult thing now in Jakarta is getting a table at Potato Head, you know, <laughs> and negotiating the traffic. Things have really steadied in the city and in the country. Uh, Paito, what message would you like investors... Yes. Uh, what message would you like to send to investors? Uh, I think only one message, uh, do come to Indonesia and invest in Indonesia because I think it is uh, still the best bet in the region uh, uh, in par with China. What, what are your priorities? You're the new guy in that position. <laughs> what are your priorities? What would you like to do or see? Okay. Um, all our, our priorities for me because my term uh, only three years. Uh, so that uh, I would like to attract, uh, as I mentioned before, the uh, uh, mining companies or energy companies owned by uh, foreign investors to list in Jakarta Stock Exchange. I would like to build the uh, Indonesian Stock Exchange IT infrastructure so that uh, we have an integrated system between uh, self-regulatory organizations and also the brokers. Uh, we also uh, would like to have uh, state-owned companies to list uh, the, the stocks in, Jakarta, uh, the Indonesia Stock Exchange. Okay, Paito Warsito so of the exchange. Good Pardon? luck, Paito.